Dallas was one of many places to hold a statewide job fair for veterans earlier today. As our Steve Pickett reports, the job offers focus on helping veterans, but the job providers are also beneficiaries. Starts off at fifteen fifty an hour. An open house of opportunity, and Noe Delgado joined the crowd around noon. I just transitioned out like two weeks ago. Delgado served his country with the Marines. He, along with at least 200 others, perusing this job fair for military veterans. He's hoping to find work that serves a specific purpose for his life now. Like, I'm just um, really open to whatever job uh, is, that's hiring at this point that's part-time or, or that allows me to do a work from home due to, like, uh, going to school. Put your information down, we'll give you a call. Yeah. And then I'll give Major you companies and corporations to local school districts and family-owned operations all taking part in Dallas's version of the state's red, white, and new job fair for vets and their family members. There were over 10,000 openings here represented by 70 employers, and the jobs are all up here in North Texas. The companies represented here today have a familiar refrain, the same story over and over. We need people. We need help. We got jobs. Anna Bresser's cleaning services business sat in the same circumstances as every job recruiter here today. Despite outreach to these veterans, there's simply not enough job takers compared to job offers, particularly when the pay rate may hover around $15 to $20 an hour. Veteran Delgado's plan? Find work here today, but his career will come after college, he says. In Dallas, Steve Pickett, CBS 11 News.